It's time to up your content game. This is CapCut Effects 101. Welcome to the CapCut YouTube channel. If this is the first video you're seeing from our CapCut 101 tutorial series, hello, welcome. And if it's not your first time, welcome back. Make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you can get weekly tutorials and product updates on all things CapCut. This is the fifth video in an 11 part series of CapCut 101 to take you from an editing beginner to an editing aficionado. So if you haven't caught the other tutorials, definitely go check those out. Today, I wanna to show you how to use effects to create thumb-stopping, fun, and engaging content. So without further ado, let's open the CapCut desktop app and get started. Everything we're gonna talk about in this video is in the effects section on the left side of the screen. At the top here, you'll see video effects. This is gonna change the look and feel of your video as a whole. And you can see here that we have a ton of different subcategories depending on what vibe you're going for. For example, the opening and closing subcategory features effects that are great for introductions and conclusions. So let's say you wanted to add an effect to signify different chapters or segments of your videos, it would be great to pull from here. The TV section has cool effects that mimic static or other visuals that you might find on television. These can be cool for flashbacks or even side tangents in your videos. Of course, there's also a trending section, so you can use effects that are trending on CapCut at any given time. You can always search for a specific effect by using the search bar. You can also click the star button on each effect to save it to the favorite subcategory. I always talk about how important it is to maintain a specific look and feel in your videos and frequently using the same effects can definitely achieve that. To add a video effect to your content, simply drag it on down to your timeline and place it on top of the clip of your choice. Keep in mind though that you won't be able to export a video with CapCut Pro effects unless you're a CapCut Pro user. When you click on the effect in your timeline, that dynamic menu on the right side is gonna change to an effects editor. Each effect can be edited in unique ways. Just play around with the sliders to make it your own. And you can always reset the effect to its original state by clicking the redo button. Moving back over here to the left, there's another subcategory under effects called body effects. These are gonna specifically target the subject of your video rather than the video as a whole. Much like the video effects section, you have your trending subcategory here that shows you which body effects are currently picking up steam on CapCut. Cut. I would highly recommend utilizing these. They're popular for a reason. You can also search for a specific body effect or explore the other subcategories. One of my favorite subcategories for fashion content is clone. There are just so many cool ways to emphasize your outfits in this one. Funny faces is a good one too to differentiate different characters in story time videos, or you can simply just add a comedic or darker vibe with these. Check out the black tears effect. This one is really cool and dark, I love it. If you scroll down to the background section, these will remove the background of your video and sub in rainbow heart neon colors, and so much more. These can be really great for outfit of the day or get ready with me videos too. You'll drag the body effects down to your timeline just like you would with any other. And just like video effects, each body effect has specific adjustments you can make to make it your own. You can also flex your creative muscle and stand out a little bit by layering effects on top of each other. So don't be afraid to use multiple effects at once. That's the great part about CapCut, right? You can make your content entirely fresh and distinctive. So now that you're a CapCut FX Pro, it's time to go out there and make some amazing content. Let us know what your favorite effects are in the comments, and of course, let us know what you would like to learn more about. And I will catch you in the next tutorial. Bye. Feeling inspired? Click here to explore more CapCut 101 and turn your video into a masterpiece.